Hi guys, welcome back to Bubble Pop Kids. Well, I am super, super excited because I got my first ever Kawaii box today. And here it is. Ooh, I am so, so excited. I ordered this like a month ago. It finally came. It's a monthly subscription box. It's got some of the cutest little things in there from Kawaii. I actually have no clue what's going to be in here. I haven't opened it yet. And... We also have some happy places. Ooh, I'm even more excited about these. Look, we have three little special delivery boxes. Cannot wait to open those up and see all the cute ones. And of course, I can never do a video without a little lip balm. Look at this cute pack I found. They're called Woodland Sunshine Lip Balms. No harsh chemicals, kid friendly. Look at this one's like a little raccoon and a fox. I'm not sure what the scent is on these, but I cannot wait to try them. They're so, so cute. So little time, so many amazing things to look at. What do you guys see? We open up the Kawaii box first. Here we go, we are doing this. Oh, I am so, so just crazy about this. So it says cuteness overload. Let's open the top. Ooh, look at this. At the top of the box, it says tips for the perfect unboxing. Document, share, and smile. A couple weeks ago, I showed my Nishi box opening. That was my first ever one. This is my first ever Kawaii box. Oh, it comes with this cute little paper. And I guess it shows all the things that are inside of here has a tissue and boom <laughs> here are all of our goodies looking at this little card here that came with this it looks like there's 11 different things in here whoa <laughs> so let's start first one oh look at this cute little keychain it's like a little plushie i don't know it looks like a kitty cat super cute and fuzzy you can hang it from your backpack or pencil case little treat up. Ooh, looks like some cheese doodles. Look at this bag. It is so adorable looking. Kind of looks like an owl face and it's called Tohado Caramel Corn. Mmm. <laughs> we gotta try those. Let's look at everything and then we'll look at each one separate. This one here. Ooh, what is this? It's called a Bobo Collecting Box. Wow. <laughs> what is a Bobo? I don't know, but it's such a cute little box. It's got a teddy bear piece on there. I think this would be good for putting like earrings or little pieces of jewelry. That is so, so cute. And else, so many things. Oh, I love this. If you guys ever watch my show, you know I love pens and stationery. Look at this cute little pen. It's got little popsicles on it. Oh, that is too, too precious. Perfect for back to school. Coming up next, ooh, we got a jump rope. <laughs> How funny is that? Cute little jump and skipping rope. But it actually looks so pretty. It's got all of these cute colors, kind of clear. Love it. Next up we got, what is this? Ooh, a Pusheen sleep mask. Oh, this is super soft. <laughs> How cute would it be to wear this at like a sleepover? Get your beauty sleep. Kind of reminds me of this little guy here. It's so furry. A few more things here. We have, ooh, I love these. Some cute little bling stickers. They're called Jewelry Seal. You could put them on your cell phone. You could put them on your pencil case going back to school. They are just so, so glittery. They're like a light pink color. I always use these. Let's see. Ooh, what is this? It says, today is a fruit day. What is that? <laughs> It's called Train Art Stationery. Hmm. And take a closer look at that. Oh, look at these stickers, you guys. Look how cute they are. They're the little puffy ones. They're pictures of little bows, cherries, all the cute little girly things. These are good for like scrapbooking or you could put them on your notebook and decorate. Coming to the bottom of the box here, but this has not disappointed. I love all of these cute things. Oh, look at this little comb. How cute is that? It's like a little kitty with a sailor shirt. Smile factory. That's cute to like put in your pencil case for school. You can comb your hair or your bangs. And finally, we get some candy. <laughs> I cannot read this. I'm not sure what kind of candy it is. It's got this cute little fizzy soda. We have to test it. 
And there it is, my first ever kawaii box opening. I was not disappointed with this, you guys. It had so many cute little things. We had cute little snacks, little kawaii items, a jump rope. <laughs> I didn't expect that. We even got some candy. Let's take a closer look and then we have our happy places. So number one on the list is called Pusheen Sleep Mask. And here it is. This thing is so soft. It feels like a soft little teddy bear. Let me get it unwrapped. I unwrapped it and here Wait. is our little Pusheen. I'm not even sure what a Pusheen means, but it's so, so fuzzy. This side is pink, this side is gray. I don't know, it kind of looks like a kitty cat. It's got whiskers. And this piece is also really, really soft to put around your head. I think this is perfect for beauty rest or bring into a sleepover. Next up on the list, we have some Tohado Caramel Corn. Mm, and it must be this red bag. I love caramel popcorn. Kind of looks like cheese doodles. So we're gonna test them. Ooh. Oh no, they don't look like cheese. They definitely have that caramel color. Try it. Mmm. Woo! Wow, you guys, I have never, ever tasted anything like this. These are the fluffiest. They're kind of like cheese doodles. They're fluffy and crunchy, but they are so buttery. They taste like caramel candy. Not too sweet. These are like the best little snacks ever. I gotta get more of these. <laughs> I don't even know where they sell them, but I've just never tasted anything like this. They're so light and airy. I wish you could try them. And the bag is so cute. Love it. Mm, I just ate almost half the bag. Those were so, so good. Number three, we get cute animal pill case. Oh, here it is. So it's called the Bobo Collecting Box. I guess it's supposed to put pills in here, maybe some vitamins. But I don't think you can use it for that. You can just put maybe like little pieces of jewelry. That is so adorable. Or if you're going on vacation, you can put your vitamins or whatever little medicines you're taking. But you can really put anything in here. Oh, it says 365 days smile. Next up is the Doodle Gel Pen. Oh, it's a gel pen. <laughs> I don't know what kind of pen this is, but look at these little popsicles. I am like obsessed with this one. Let's test it. Here we go. Ooh, it is like a gel pen. Super smooth. Really, really nice. It writes just as cute as it looks. Our fifth little treat here is the Kawaii Jump Rope. And it's this one here. It is so, so pretty. <laughs> it's got this cute little bear on the package. I haven't been jump roping in years, but why not start again? <laughs> It's really good exercise. Woo, take this off. <gasps> Look how pretty this is. It's kind of clear and twisted and braided. It's got all of these neon colors inside. That is so cute for like the schoolyard, going back to school, you could play with your friends. Number six is the Hearts and Bows stickers. Ooh, and these are so, so cute if you look at them. They're like those puffy 3D ones. I love these pastel colors. Here's a close-up. How amazing would these be on like your little school planner? You could put them on your pencil case if it's like a box. So many cute little ones. Oh, look at that one with the little polka dots. They're just so, so detailed. Number seven, we have the kawaii comb. Here it is. Oh, this is so, so cute. You know, you could even use this on like one of your dollies. If you have super thick hair, I don't think it would work for you. Because it's kind of tiny, but look at that. Oh. It's just so amazing looking. Kind of looks like a ruler. <laughs> a little bit. Boop. Number eight, we have the Jewelry Seal Deco stickers. Here they are. And I use these all the time when I'm doing like little craft projects. When I make my slime, I put them on the cute little jars. Here, you could put it on your jewelry box. They are just so dazzling. Whoop. 
here like this light pink color. Really, really pretty. Nine is the fruit day card keys. Oh, that's what it is. <laughs> it says today is a fruit day. I'm not sure what a day card is, but maybe you can put like your school ID in here or credit card, gift card. It just looks like some kind of a wallet. So cute for going on vacation. It's got little pineapples. Two more left before we get to our happy places. So number 10 is the round Neko plush charm. Oh, that's this little kitty one here. This is so, so squishy and furry. I love that one. I think I'm going to hang it from my purse. Final kawaii treat is the chorus salt candy stick. That must be this little blue one. Wow, I still do not know what kind of candy it is. Let's open and try it. Ooh. Kind of feels like Laffy Taffy. Feels like Taffy for sure. Oh, it smells so good. It smells like soda. <laughs> try. Mm, not too sure about this one. It tastes, it's just kind of weird. It tastes like marshmallow with a little taffy with a little bit of bubble gum and it kind of has a bubble gum texture i'm not even sure if you're supposed to swallow it or just chew it a little too sweet i'm not liking this one so much but these caramel corns this was probably the best tasting thing i ever ate in my life it's so good this one not so much and after looking at every single thing here, I have to say my favorite, favorite, well, actually my favorite was the little snack. Those were so crunchy and sweet. But my second favorite was this little popsicle pen. It wrote so smooth. And you guys can leave me a comment and let me know out of all of this kawaii stuff, which one was your favorite? Time for some happy places. Here we go. We have three little special delivery boxes and I just cannot wait. I've opened probably three before. And I got the cutest little appliances and homewares. See what we're gonna get. Another thing about these little happy places, I just wish the pieces were a little bit bigger. They're so super tiny. They're kind of hard to even hold. They could have made them just a tad bit bigger. So here we go. Open it up. Here is a tile. Each box comes with like a cute little tile to put together. And the blind bag, we get three little happy places. And our home collection guide. Here we go, here's the first side. Ooh, it's silver. Oh, look at this cute little thing. It kind of looks like an iPod. <laughs> what is it? In the third little bag, we have, oh, this is a big one. Finally, I got one that's a little big. We got this cute little table. Looks like a pet kin. And the last, before we put them all together and find out what they are, we have... Oh, this one is so, so cute. It looks like a little planter. It looks like a milkshake, too. What is it? <laughs> Coming in from the puppy parlor. Oh, that's so cute. They do look like puppy faces. We have this one, Music Player. That's what it looks like, like a tiny little iPod. We also have Side Table and Rose Vase. It's like a little flower vase with roses. I love how they all match together. I'm kind of new to the Happy Places, so I'm just trying to figure it out. Looking at the paper, there's a puppy parlor section. And we have the little kitty kitchen. I have some of these. I've collected those. Um, what else? Over here, the dreamy bear, the bathing bunny. Oh, I have some of these little bathroom appliances. They're just too, too adorable for words. Let's open this one. Alrighty. <laughs> I just cannot wait to get this whole collection. That will be so cute. We're going to have like a little Shopkins house. Ooh, and this tile is purple. Here's our bed. Rip these babies open. Let's see. Ooh, this one comes with a couple pieces. Oh, this may be the cutest one so far. Look at this. It looks like a little cooking or boiling pot. It even comes with this cute little pink lid. How funny is that? 
You know these also kind of remind me of little Barbie things. <laughs> the cute little Barbie accessories. They're just so, so little. Second one up is, ooh, where is it? This one is really little. <laughs> I almost missed it. How fun. <gasps> this is the tiniest little thing. What? You know, it looks like an egg. Wow, that last one was like almost microscopic. I <laughs> we could have made it a little bit bigger. And the last third one here. Ooh, we get a couple pieces. <gasps> this is so, so cute. Look, look, this looks like a little egg cup. And a baking pan. Maybe it goes like that. Find out their names. Oh, I think this set is actually cuter than the last one. Look at that cute little egg. He looks like a little chipmunk. So coming in from the kitty kitchen, we get egg. Here it is. Look at that tiny little thing. And we also get egg cup. And then there's like a little tray here. I guess you can like lay the egg down. And this one here is pot. It's a little kitchen pot for boiling. <gasps> these are just awesome. And to the final one, you know, I wasn't getting these so much. I thought they were kind of tiny, but now that I'm getting more of them, they are just so, so cute. I think I may even like them more than the regular Shopkins. <laughs> That's just how adorable they are. All these cute little appliances and kitchen wares. Ooh, we got a turquoise one. Let's see what the partner are for. Okay, what is this? Ooh, this is tiny. Oh, I actually have this one already. It's a little toothbrush. My first happy place duplicate. And in the middle, is it gonna be? Ooh, I have this one too. It is a little toothbrush holder. How amazing is that? Fits right inside. And the last, if I remember, is a cup. <laughs> it's like a bathroom cup, and these are from the bunny collection. They have little bunny ears. Love those colors. Here's a super close up of those, and they're coming in from which one is that? Mm, the bathing bunny department. And there they are, all three of our little happy place tiles clipped together. We have living room kitchen and the bathroom. They are just too, too, too. And out of every single piece here, I think my favorite is probably this little egg cup one. Just because it looks like a little chipmunk. So, so cute. That was such a good idea. And you guys can leave me a comment and let me know out of all these little happy places, which one was your fave? Moving on from the happy places, and I am just so in love with those. We're gonna have so many more coming up on the show. They are just too precious. Next up, we have our final surprise of the show, and it's some lip balm. Look at this cute little package. And I've had these before with different characters. They're no harsh chemicals, kid friendly, and they are super shiny. They smell so good. Let's open them. Here's our little lippies out of the box. Look how cute they are. They look like little balls. One is a raccoon. This looks like a fox. We get a blue and a pink. I'm so curious what the scent is gonna be. Oop, let's got it. Here we go. It's kind of like a light blue bomb. <gasps> but one thing I love about these woodland ones, look how shiny that is. It looks like a lip gloss. Your lips are gonna be beautiful. And it smells like a sugar cookie. So moisturizing. I had these before. I think they were like little panda bears. It smells so sweet, like a cupcake or vanilla frosting. Really, really sweet scent. And you just cannot believe how shiny these are. Next up is our little pink fox. Oh, look at those cute details. She's got little flowers. And this one is, ooh, this one's pink inside. And it smells delicious. Smells just like a cupcake, just like this one. I don't know what the scent is. It's either cupcake, whipped cream, ice cream. Very, very creamy and sweet. Love it. And this one is just as moisturizing. This one actually has a little bit of a pinkish tint to it, which I love. A clear pink gloss. Oops, backwards. There we go. 
And there it is, that's the end of the video. And the only way to describe this is just like a video of cuteness. Everything in here was so cute from all the kawaii stuff. We got our little happy places, our lip balms, and we are gonna have so many more fun videos coming up on the shelf. This is Bubble Pop Kids. You can click this big red subscribe button here and subscribe to our channel. Have a great day, bye.